King Admetus is dying. His people grieve. Apollo demands a human sacrifice and will not be satisfied with anything else. Queen Alceste is willing to give up her life for the love of her husband. Unaware of the cause of his sudden recovery, Admetus appears at court. He asks his beloved queen why she wears such a sad face when everything is going so well for them and he lives by the good grace of the gods, to which he unwittingly adds, and by the gift of Alceste's love. Let us now hear my recitative and aria from the second act of Alceste. King learns who has chosen to die for him, that it is Alceste, his faithful wife, who will sacrifice herself. He follows her, reaching her just in time before the gates of hell. In the following recitative and aria, Admetus pleads with Alceste to let him be the one to die, as he cannot imagine life without her. He defies the old barbarian gods who have brought this terrible fate upon them, but Alceste is determined to die for him. Vivre sans toi, moi, vivre sans Alceste, vivre pour la bonne la lumière céleste, il s'est par moi, encore tout mon mot, sans cesse ni chéri, pas de tout mon nouveau, j'y l'ai des jours, que je ne casse je pourrais, si Sois 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. 